Miles gets back, the best thing we can do is keep everyone fed. Oh, Peter, it is so good to see you. How are you? Healthy? I'm good. How are you holding up? Good, but busy. Oh, let me go. Oh, there. <coughs> Okay. Didn't you tell me something once about accepting that I'm human just like everyone else? You and the uh, <coughs> masters at turning my own words against me. I'm fine, Peter. Just a little run now. Where's Miles? Could he help out? Oh, he is. He's off picking up medical supplies from the relief center. It's amazing how quickly we go through antibiotics. Okay. <laughs> Synchronized bomb scratch. <laughs> I'll organize the unloading and check in with Miles. Deal? Deal. Give me a chance to nurse my wounded Parker pride. Come on, Miles, answer. Don't make me worry about you and me. If any problem, if he's got any problem, it'll be Sable. I don't think the gangs usually actually there no, we'll see where the gangs go. Quiet, quiet. So much for a milk run. And a bunch of convicts even do this. Looks like an exploding bulldozer went through here. I can't turn back. Bees needs those antibiotics. You hear the sound his head made when the big guy hit him? Like a who's there? Need to distract him. Hacking apps should work. Time to move. Well, my favorite, and now I found the exploding bulldozer. <laughs> exploding bulldozer. No! Yes, no! Gentlemen, 
I apologize. My associate is inelegant. He doesn't understand the fine art of persuasion. And neither do you. Wow, that was um no how do I escape then? Don't think you saw me. Time to get out of here. What is it? Come out! I have the time for this. We are having fun with it right now! I will have fun with this game! Come out! And I promise to crush! First, we lost the last time. Oh, God, Jesus Christ! I mean, stop throwing random stuff. Stupid boxes. So it's getting it. Well, can't really do much so after you think of a different way of going. Time to run. It's against the rider.
That's my exit. I think I'll try another way. Hmm. Is there another way? Is there another generator of some sort? Run, run, Mars! Run, run, run! Clear the opening. Go, run, 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 run! Go, go, go! Mars, go! Scary times. You're still not safe, Miles. You let me know I have these. Get off me! Just give us the wall! Give it us, man! Kid. You can't just push people around like that. Oh what? Like this? <laughs> Kids got guts. Hip square. Oh, I'm using miles to fight. Come on. What the hell's he saying? He's saying anything in a second. He's knocked him out. You coming next? Nah, I'm good, kid. You want a taste? I gotta work on my fight, man. Miles? Hey, I've been trying to reach you. Are you okay? Hey, hey so, uh, don't, don't freak, freak out, out, but, um, I gotta <laughs> fill you in on some stuff. Okay. Miles is going to know that he's Spidey one day. Currently I'm using, I forgot to mention that I've changed my suit and I'm using the Stark industry, so the one from Homecoming, I'm actually using that Spider-Man one, so, yeah. Incredible work, Miles. Stick close to Feast. If the convicts get desperate, they may try to raid the shelter. Way ahead of you. Anything else happens here, I'll let you know. Great. So... Yeah. Yuri, figured out Rhino's deal. He's attacking Oscorp's relief centers. Think I know which one he's hitting next. Reports of a possible earthquake and or demolition derby at the Harlem Center. Sounds like our boy. Headed there now. You holding up? A I'm going over to Harlem. It's about 3,000 odd miles away. So, yeah, quick travel. Is it still stable and... The gangs. Yep, pretty much. Honestly, how did that guy not see his legs? Ugh. Anyway. Let's go. Hey, this is random, but even though the 
I don't have time for that, sorry. Pick on someone your own size, Rhino. There is no one my size, punk. Or maybe we could just talk it out. Rhino, just put the team up. We thought you were alone. Means and ends, Paul! All of that means and ends! Oh, like the only way to fight him. Let's it. wrap this up. Ooh. Ooh, Matrix. Never spend an eight ton in to do a man's job. Let's finish this. Oh, Scorch, love you, but you do know it's really cut in, right? What were you gonna do? Like an old married couple, you two. Oh, Scorpion was quite easy to fight. <laughs> was just only part one of it. If he finds out you failed, I failed. Yes, never put two animals together. Time might help you boys learn to play nice. <laughs> Quiet time. Four down. Just Octavius and Lee left. Something tells me they won't be as easy. They're only half our problem, though. Devil threat cases are getting worse, and Oscorp will see Koi not an anti serum. I'm worried they're seeing dollar signs in a seller's market. I'd expect nothing less from our beloved mayor. Leave Devil's breath to me, or my best people is on it. Okay. 
Okay then. So that's all done, and now we're. Hey, hey. I've been through the city, state, and federal databases. If this Devil's Breath Lab does exist, it's off the books. The only other place I can think to look is in Norman's personal files. I've already been through his office computer. Are you thinking he's a penthouse? That building's full of Sable's men. If they spot me, other residents could get hurt in a firefight. I know, but I might be able to get in undetected. I can sneak in, find the lab's location, and get out. If anything goes wrong, I'll call you for backup. Okay. It's risky, but we need that location. Wait for me to get nearby, then make your move. I'll be ready. Alright, so... Looks like we're going to be MJ one last time before anything, so... Once again, guys, that's another episode for you guys to look into. Uh, thank you very much for watching. Hey, MJ, just calling you back. You doing okay? I'm fine. Just calling through Oscorp records. Random, but you remember that trip we took to Staten Island with Harry? To find the best pizza in the city? Yeah. Ten hour odyssey for burnt toast with cold American cheese. How could I forget? Something about all these old Oscorp files made that day pop into my head. Harry was so excited about riding the ferry. Just made me think about how much simpler things were back then. No jobs, no super villains. We could throw away a whole day looking for bad pizza just cuz. You know, it feels like if we take a nap, the world will fall apart. Yeah, yeah. this adult, adult thing is rough. But I, guess I guess the work, work we do means today's kids can have their own Staten Island adventures. adventures. In, in safety. safety. Kind of a circle of life thing. Circle of bad pizza. <laughs> yeah, you're right. That's a good way to look at it. Thanks, Pete. Okay, thank you very much for watching another episode of Marvel Spider-Man and I hope you enjoyed it. Make sure to like, subscribe and comment below if there's anything that you want me to do. Once again, thank you very much and we are so close to the end.